As a child, I grew up with animals. I had a dog. I had a couple of rabbits. We even had chickens in the backyard. I grew up on a farm in southwestern Minnesota. Uh, I was a lot younger than my older brothers. So my, my friends, my playmates, were all the animals. I just always enjoy being with animals. And we've had animals ever since we've been married. I can't imagine a life or a home without an animal. By taking care of the animals, you're also taking care of the people. I've always said when I die, I want to be reincarnated as a cat taken care of by my wife. Cass County is, is a very, very large county. It's one of the only counties in the state of Minnesota that does not have an animal shelter or any animal program. There's a great need in Cass County for an animal shelter. We decided that we'd step up to the plate. Betty and I don't have any children. Now what about our personal estate? What would we really like to see? And we talked about it and uh, we said, well, let's do something for animals. Paws and Claws Animal Shelter will be a destination for Cass County. Not only will it serve the animals, it'll provide jobs, and our mission statement is saving animal lives, educating youth, completing families. So we're going to have an auditorium in there, a classroom where uh, there could be educational tours, there'd be different programs and classes in the various schools, and that's really what we hope to have an emphasis on. What's near and dear to my heart will be the training facility. The training facility using uh, hopefully mostly rescue dogs, the shelter dogs, where they uh, train the dogs to really help the veterans. We're, we're going to take it step at a time. We want to get one facet up and running and successful, move to the second, build on it. And the more we build on it and the more the people see what we're doing, the more support we'll get from the community. Anyone who knows Jack and Betty know that when they do something, they do it right. The thing that excites me about this project is it's, it's, it's more than just a project that's um, something that you'll finish and it's there. Like many of the things that Jack and Betty do, their intent is to have it, have it live, live on and continue to live on. Jack and I have traveled all over the world, but our best times are right out here, right on Man Lake. Heaven's sakes, this is home. The property is in a uh, endowment through the Initiative Foundation. We're able to lease it back from them every year, so you know we can live here until we're old and, and uh, not able to use the, the place anymore. And then the, the proceeds from the, uh, the land will go toward the Paws and Claws Animal Shelter. All of us have passions in life. Sometimes you just have to narrow down what your real passion is uh, and have a hand in developing it. The way I feel about Jack and Betty, they're a couple that have worked very hard. They realize that no matter what, you can't take it with you. And the way that they're handling the disposition of the assets in the animal shelter is one of the most magnificent and generous, heartwarming things I have ever seen any couple do.